left of the box. Uh, oh, you've told me how to say your name before and I'm totally forgetting it. AJ left fave. I want to cry. I hate that most Canadians are not driven by a moral center that calls them to care for others. I feel that's what always made Canada a good country. That is the maple washing, yes. There was always this sense of Canadians being friendly neighbors, good people, super polite, all this sort of stuff. But, you know, you just start peeling off the layers and you realize that's never who this country has been. You know, it's never been about your neighbors. And you can see that with like the unhoused encampments and stuff. And I've been to a city council meeting talking about this, uh, standing up when I was losing my housing and talking about, you know, the people in that council meeting, the witnesses, the, the, um, uh, oh my gosh, what are they called again? The council members and all that sort of stuff. And I was saying to them, it's like, I have no doubt that all of you feel like you're good people, that if your neighbor was in trouble, you would help them out. If there was a fire in their house, you would help them out that, you know, you, you you would do your part to make sure that they were okay. So when did I stop becoming your neighbor? When did those people in those tents stop being your neighbor? When did people with disabilities stop being your neighbor? And yeah, because <laughs> They're all willing to help their neighbors of a certain class, of a certain status. But when it comes to their neighbors that are suffering on the streets, that are suffering trying to keep housing, suddenly they're not neighbors anymore. And it used to be that image that all Canadians were neighborly to each other. But that's not the case. It's really not the case. And you know, growing up, realizing that Canada is nothing what I thought of when I was a child. It's, you know, it, it, it used to be part of like who I thought of myself as, you know, Canadian and all this sort of stuff. And just learning that a part of my identity has always been just this dark, <laughs> this, this, it's been a lie that this country has taught people. But part of the morals that they taught me to have about holding people accountable, seeking justice, fighting for others, well, that kind of got ingrained in me. And that is why I'm calling out Canada. So Canada, you kind of did it to yourself. I'm here doing this channel because of what you taught the maple version of Canada you taught me to be.